and happy Monday. And I'm so excited to get to see you again. Today we are going to move on to a more tutorial for is uh, Velvet Gels. So as you see last week, I did have a great time creating a lot of tutorial with you using is newest six colors of uh, Velvet Gels with a thermos and glow in the docks collection so today's what we're gonna do is really cool fans i have an idea it's really cool it's content i'm gonna share with you we are going to do a raspberry colors and a grapes and we are going to use these two colors for ombre and is one of really really um beautiful chanfor for collection is number 107 one of the newest ones and i'm gonna use this to like have um a source and uh like have um chick Checker. chickers so Checker beautiful pack. so let's play with this and see what happens gonna be with that mail i'm so i'm so excited and i know that it's gonna turn out really great so this is the designs that we did it's like throughout the weeks there's more but it's not gonna show it on the screen so every single video is step by step and if you miss this definitely check it out and you can uh, still re-watching them from our IGTV, which is on Instagram uh, videos and Facebook video, YouTube videos, and also we are um, have smaller clips on both now at TikTok and then also with Pinterest as well. So we also streams uh, on Twitch as well. So four platform right now. So thank you so much, uh, Instagram fam, Facebook fam, Twitch fam, and uh, YouTube fam so thank you so so much for tuning in and let's moving on move this away so then we can start creating as, as more um content so i got the nails the swatch right here so if you're doing it for your nails or your clients make sure you prep the client's nails with is um a dry manicure and also you are going to uh, clean it with PRC tone to remove all the oil and then after that we are going to apply the bay gels and just a thin coat here for 10 seconds okay and I did 10 seconds already so now I'm going to apply the premium I hold chant for foil and then we're gonna do it just about half, half of the nails like about 50 percent okay make sure you cover whole entire the nails Premium I hope chanfer foils will give it really easy and will help chanfer it completely in like a 30 seconds. So here for 30 seconds. Uh, I might keep that though. Okay, so and then I'm gonna do another one and we are still going to add it on um, premium I hope channel for four. Hello everyone, thank you, thank you for tuning in and welcome to Glitz Assistant Sash Live Tutorial. If you are first time tuning in, thank you so much. If you are first time stopping by, thanks so much for stopping by. So excited, so so excited. And then you can find like a thousand of videos absolutely free for you uh, on our um Crocs platform social medias. You can find us on YouTube, uh, Facebook, Instagram, and also on TikTok, Twitch, and Pinterest as well. So this one is done with is um, 30 seconds dry already. I'm going to move this one for just a second. And this nails, I'm going to use it with raspberry. So I'm going to try to get this, this closer colors. And this is really cool because it like it translucent. So you can use it. Like I'm in the clear background, so you can use this as um, on the top of the colors, or you can use this um, on the clear, completely the clear, clear tip to get it. It's like cool effects. Completely. So I did just half of the nail, so it's trying for everything for you. And the box is 107. And then select so moving on to the next one scene is just came out from the LED lamp. Again, I just keep for 30 seconds. So this is the box number 107. I'm not using another image right here. Love this sword design. So 
apply the chamfer foil gels for uh, oil and tie the nails. I mean, half of the nails. If you all decide to do oil and tie the nails, you make sure you apply it's oil and tie the nails. So I am going to remove it. Give a good pressures and you can remove completely. Hello, everyone. Thank you so much for tuning in. It's only chamfer where is the chamfer foil gels apply. So again, I use number um, 107's box. All right, so for this is really cool, is pink checkers. I'm gonna use raspberry. And it's really cool because it's gonna changing the colors later. So I'm so, so excited. And then the grapes gonna be for this sore nails, okay? And we'll do some crystal placement. So I'm gonna using a velvety gel brush, which is, is dual. You have one end with the brush. Special for velvety gels, really thick, um, good quality of a bristle. So it's not going to shredding when you are doing yours a beautiful art. And on the other end is, is a spatula so you can get your uh, velvety gels easier. So, and I have it right in my place here. I drop a couple drop of the bay gel. So our velvety gel exclusive using is bay gel to manipulating and then to sculpting the nails, which is that it's not going to harden or is breaking down your product. It's not only um, make it easy, smooth, and uh, flow easy. It's also is going to really give it is the time for you to manipulating it without having them harden. So I'm going to pick the smaller beads. And it's really cool about velvety gels. You are not going to worry about if you are using it too much or too little because guess what? If you're feeling it too much, you can always remove it. And if you feel it too little, you can absolutely add more. So it, no limits of what you can do and create with velvety gels. And as you can see that the consistency, it's just so beautiful. So I'm not using spatulas and then get about like a medium's uh, feet. And then just guide it. And it has like all the time in the wars. You can able to manipulating it. And it's also a self level. But a self level perfect to the point that you are not going to be like, oh, my God, oh, my God. My my um, bead is starts, you know, velvety's gel or is um, the bead is started getting like um, self level so fast. You know, no, it's self level to the point that you can able to still continue manipulating it. So I'm going to close the leads. Make sure you close the leads. So this is really is good tip and perfect for beginner nail techs, um, DIY now at home. Also for a lot of you and nail technicians have uh, been a long time and some, some, another, something else that you can able to utilize and edit another service for your clients absolutely odorless and um sustainable ingredients and also so easy to manipulating so i you can see that since i place it down here you can see it starts getting really self level it's beautiful i can't wait to show you when it starts changing buying um when the temperature is changing hot and cold in the body you see when you're getting on your um nails this part going to turn like lighter because your body on the nail place is going to be warmer and it will change right away. So it's make it look so beautiful. So I am submerging my brush into the bay gels just a little bit, pick it up just a little bit. And if you're seeing that I'm turning um, the nails on the swatch on the sides, you can see that instead of 45 degree angle, because if you're doing that, your tips of your bristle will pull majority of the gels. The same concept when you're doing get other techniques for um, a liquid and powder as well. So you're going to do which is parallel, keep your bristle parallels with the nails, and you're going to blend it instead of using the tip because when using the tips all of the pressure is going to go right on the tip of the bristle is going to pull out most of the gels you don't want it you want the gel to be flows um much possible all right really really cool you know what this is the best time if you want to add like uh if you want to add some glitters on uh, if you want to add something else on it's a great time to do it now However, I'm going to put some crystal placement in here. 
So I'm gonna let it set for like a flash here for 30 seconds, okay? And then we're gonna ca cap it with the crystal clear. Hey everyone, thanks so much for tuning in. Welcome, welcome to Glitz Assessing and Such Live Tutorials. So I'm gonna be picking about a medium size of the Velvety Gels. And then I am going to cap. Look at that, how beautiful it is. It's form is like a raspberry, it's like a pink pink. And then the chin's lighter. And as it's getting warmer, it's even a lighter. It's so beautiful. So I'm gonna add it right on the nails. And I am going to blend it. If you feel like you want to cap completely the nails, you absolutely can. But I'm going to do the importance is you're going to do it right in the part of um, the ombre part. You want your ombre to able to be protect because then <laughs> when you start filing them, you don't want your ombre, beautiful ombre part is going to be gone, you know. And don't purposely don't have to manipulate it too much. You just turn it upside down and let it like self level itself. This is great for like me. I've been really enjoying it. So if for the beginner nail takes or for the folks who've been doing it now forever and really want to take your business to the next level and absolutely will be a solution because it's all the less and it's so fast when you're filing and shaping them very much you can do is a lot of um custom nails with the velvety gels so you can see that how cool and is like set level is and now you can able to like adjusting it as you wish Really, really gentle. Sorry, did I move it too high? All right, so now I'm happy with this. We are going to cure this one for 60 seconds. You can see on the side how cool it is. Okay. And it's just stay nice and smooth for you. So moving on, I'm so excited because as I say, if you want to see like all tutorial with solid nail, there was a uh, full tutorials as well last week. We did so many six colors, beautiful and solid snails. I mean, the solid colors. And then you also can see that ours like um, first collection was six primary colors. I did a lot with the solid colors as well. So now we are branching into a lot of nail art because then that way we can do it from a start to advance. So you can really enjoying it and then see how beautiful and how easy you can um, achieve. So I'm moving on my beautiful grapes colors. And uh, is grape colors is one of them. I have it here. I really enjoying it. This is this is one of nails I did. Um, you can definitely watching them from our IGTV too. Look at the grapes. This one I will last week. So uh, feel free to check them out on our videos i saved them all for you all right so moving on grapes here i am going to pick same thing medium beads again feel if you're feeling like it's really is not like enough you can absolutely add more okay or if you feel like oh my god too much too much i picked too much of the um of the velvety gel you absolutely can uh, remove it and Put it back in to your jars. Okay. Okay. This is older, absolutely older less. I don't smell nothing. Oh, not like you sleep in it, and it's really limits of the. Here you go. Right here, where are we? Right there, so you can see it better. 
All right, so now is you can start seeing it is like salt level for you. And do not worry, like you don't have to be panicking that, oh my God, it's gonna run, it's not going anywhere. Um, thank you so much, Laura. Hello, happy Monday. Thanks so much for tuning in. So I'm gonna submerge my brush into the beige gel for a lot of you just tuning in. I'm using beige gel to manipulating and sculpting the Gliss Velvet Gel, so that's why. It's not only going to flow really nice, and then even though you wear your nails, it's going to be so flexible, and it's not going to be brittle or it's hot. And also, that is not going to break down your products. So I'm going to using submerging my brush into the beige gels, and then I'm going to like keep the bristles like stay really nice and parallels, and blend this beauties out. And then we are going to um, and we are going to apply the um, crystal clear on later. All right, so I'm gonna get just a little bit of the glitter cornflake or glitter this one this one better just a little bit hint of a glitter oh my god i love this so you can do with whole nails as well hey pa gasoline how are you so good to see you happy monday thanks so much everyone for tuning in so I'm using all season glitter, just getting a little bit top. And then just a little bit. You can leave the source absolutely. And then I'm going to add some, just a little bit, just a hint of it. I don't want to be going too much. All right. You can add some more. You don't have to like settle with less. You can absolutely do a little bit more. Okay. Flash cue first for um, 30 seconds. And then we are going to cap it with crystal clear. So how everyone doing today? I'm so excited. Get to see you again. Vicky gets really beautiful works on Saturday. Don't forget to check out all our BA team. They're so talented and I'm absolutely really happy to share with you a lot of contents. Oh my gosh, this is so beautiful. This is already capped with crystal clear. We want to do a clean it. You see that basically you do not have to have a lot of, you know, filing at all. It's already pretty much done for you. I'm going to close my crystal clear. And here is this one already. Oh my God, look, it's so stunning. The grapes, when it gets like a warm up on the LED lamp. So I'm gonna cap it completely the nails. Or it's a part of the ombre. I You can feel that I did a little bit more of the crystal clear. I'm gonna put it back in. All right. Here is the crystal clear. I know it's hard to choose what colors, but if you, in case you love that, how consistency is, you have to get one color first, get crystal clear. However, I don't know. It's hard to choose. I will probably pick pink or blueberry. I like it. I like lemonade too. So. I know get the new color because it's so cool for is a holiday coming. You have not only a glow in the dark. It's gonna be so cool and stunning in like a fall time that you have your glow in the dark nails. And then it is um changing too. When it changes, it still glow. But then crystal clear doesn't glow any other colors. So I'm gonna like submerging my brush into the beige gels and really gently 
is um, feathers and guiding the crystal clear and got it in on the edges on the sides so i'm gonna just turn it like upside down to so give it a little bit of the um salt level all right i'm gonna turn it like this wipe this off hey dom thank you so much for tuning in yes this is beauty and enjoys your um 30 percent off of a lot of products so i hope you enjoy the saving for special launch velvety gels can you um, focus on for me see how it just like really set level for you already so then if you need to adjusting anything absolutely All right. Perfect. Great. So now I am going to key it for 60 seconds to completely dry. And then we can start doing some cute crystal placement. Hello, Brazil. Brazil also is one of the glitz um, accessory and such. When ambassador would have Hey Dom do my nails. But then now she's at Simply Nail Aiden. So please follow her. If all of you are following her on the other page, so just technical difficulty. So she couldn't use that at the moment. So you can follow her at Simply Nail Eden and then Brazil at Valley's Nails. And we have is um, Mika at Mika Do Nails. And we have Vicky at Vicky Jensen. We have Isabel at Skillmatics Nails. And you can also follow my other page at Beauty Forever 4 with number 4, Forever with Nancy. So uh, we're so excited. You, We are so excited to get to see you in person as next month is so fast. We extremely busy in getting is a lot of trip shows, uh, big trip shows this ready. So then we can do the best and uh, prep the best of we could so then we can able to bring the best to you. So I am going to using a 99% alcohols and just remove all of a residues tacky layer. And then we are going to use the file number 180 and 100 glitz file. And just really is, you know what, be honest, even if you watching, I did the set for Vicky the other day. I do not have to find it too much. It's already salt level. Look at that. It's not like it's have a big lumps or anything. It's already smooth. You can see that reflection of the light, the lights right here. You see that? It's really pretty much. And then buff it. It's not only when you're doing your swatch, you're doing it right on the natural nails, uh, on the client's nails. Same thing. This makes my life so much easier. So I'm gonna buff it, buff that, you know, right in the centers and down, down toward to the edges on the side wall. And then you are going to clean it again to remove all the dust. Very much. Look at that, how saving so much time from um shipping and filing so i'm gonna moving on to the next one puts this beauties right here so then we're collecting the dust Same, we don't need it to collecting it because it's ready for crystal placements everyone hello happy monday hope you all have a fabulous is the first day of the week all right so i'm gonna remove the is tacky layer off and then wipe so now it's no more tacky so i can able to shape it straight and using the buff hi sylvia hi pat um our gasoline hello Thank you so much for gasoline for amazing batch. Thank you, thank you. Okay, so all the buff cleans. 
you know, it's stunning because it's going to change the colors really, really soon. All right. So let going, uh, moving to the crystal placements. I like that one here a lot. I'm going to show you what I'm going to do. So now here's a, some cool tip and trick. So if you feel like, oh my gosh, I don't know what I want to do with the crystal placement. I couldn't get the centerpiece down. I couldn't get them put together. Grab one of the is a metal mix, a centerpiece. It has like 10 pieces. You can have so much time. I so much fun with this. I have, I've been using it and they almost gone. I have one, two, three, four, four left. This is, um, it is the charm that I pick it up, but I have two. So I've been using six of them already. So I have six, I have four left. But definitely, I'm going to have so much fun with this. Um, and now I am going to pull my beautiful is bubbles, like like a look like a bubble, but it gloves. Um, you know what? It's just going to be cool too. Just if you put pom pom in there, it's going to look so stunning as well. So let's do it. Some cute, cute, cute um, nails with this one. I'm going to use this too because a lot of you get this. And I did quite a few videos with that one but also i just really want to do more so then you can see how beautiful it is and you can create so many designs with those um crystal and it's so smooth it doesn't look like um scratching or anything at all so we're gonna start with the first step from our trifecta and if you have to pick one item for to make your crystal placement is you know really really perfect and stay on the nails for few weeks this is going to be your best if you have to get one item i would suggest get this because you have condensed glue gel no web top gold precision glue gel so it's like a triple of security and then you have your is extra of yours mega mix uh colors and sizes of the crystal so then you can definitely have so much fun to create it you will never go wrong with that so really thick density oh my gosh look at that sorry it was I'm going to take care of it. That's happened when it's a Friday, I think. That's yeah. what happened. And it's really whole inside the tray, but it's still there. It was, it's staying there and it's got really secure. How was that really messy, though? But it's okay. Okay. So now you see how condensed glue with extra crystals. <laughs> it's extra crystals, like condensed glue gel. All right. So really thick density. You can see that how I spread my bristle is. And do not panic because it's supposed to be like that. It's unlike any other. So, and it's enough. You don't want to do two thicks, which is the only thick density. So you want to make sure you blend it out. And then you are going to apply the no wet top coat floating on the top. So between condensed blue gel and no wet top coat, it will definitely encourage your crystal, your charm, your frame. Your chains in absolutely one place. All right, so let's get this beauties on these nails. And it's go really nice because it's curved the way we want it. I'm gonna get this two beauty. Well, you know what? I want the big one though. I want to show you how big this one is. Is that pretty? Oh my gosh. Okay. It's so adorable. Do not afraid it to go big because when either you go big or you go home. So don't feel like, oh my God, it's too big. My clients will never wear it. Oh, trust me, they will wear even bigger. So don't scare yourself. Just do it. It's experience to me because I'm not just saying it because I'm saying it. Just actually, it's just like I have the same feeling when I first start with the crystal placement and they are, oh my God. What if the client's not going to pay? They are not going to wing it. They're just like, oh, I'm busy with this. I can't wing my nails. I have my kids. I got to do a ABC. It's just a lot. Every um, 10 people, you're probably going to get like a nays for so many. 
So keep doing it. Keep weighing the beautiful nail art on your nail until you. they were so like um, contagious and say, oh my God, okay, that's it. I am going to get it like your nails. So I'm gonna continue, it's so, so cool though. I don't know how to explain it. Like um, if you go into like um, the glass museum, like the glass, Shuhili, no, what it called? She, what is that? No, hold on, let me remember. I didn't take you, we didn't go, huh? But yes, Shuhili, the, the, um, the, the glass, the glass museum. museum. It's so beautiful, that's how they, there's a lot of cool nail art funds and then that is my inspiration to create this cool design for this look See, it looks um, nice though it's almost like it's wavy from the top to the bottom go from like 2d encapsulate and into into 3d because it's like it grew out the nail is that cool it, and it's so cool though if you see in person you gotta experience this in person you know what it's under the five dollars nail art you can have so much money look at this it looks cool though uh, hard to explain you gotta see it in person and then you have to try it on your nail because it looks so i know it's hard because i keep saying it and i can't find the right word to explain what it is but if you are in the museum of the glass you know exactly what i'm talking about i don't know how it's like blow the glasses All right, I'm gonna tuck some of Beauty's beads in here. You can do silver, you can do gold, you can do rose gold, you can do obsidian, you can do uh, white gold, it doesn't matter. You do what you, it fit with your taste and your client taste. You don't have to stick with gold that I have. Um, I do, a lot of time I do silver as well. So a lot of time I do rose gold too. So, total limits of what you can do. I'm gonna tuck it right in. So here, I just share with you that I'm using a centerpiece. It makes my life also easier because um, if you're not sure what uh, is crystal, you are going to place them together. You can definitely always count on the uh, centerpiece. Centerpiece will never going to um, disappoint you. So I'm going to add more beads. And the best way to add beads on to tuck them in right between the crystals or right between the frame or right between the uh, charms. Okay, dang it, it's on. Right, I love the swirling. I love the glitters like hidden underneath. And now I absolutely loving this gloves crystal. You can really simplify this on the $5 nail art. Five colors. So before I am keying, I am going to adjusting it. That's the best thing about condensed glue gels and no white top coat is not going to set and key it until you are going to key it under LED lights. It looks absolutely stunning. But then I really feel like I want to add some frame on it. You think? That's fine. That looks perfect by itself. You know what? We always want more. But you can add like some frame on it. Let's see. You try to stop me. Easy. All right, so I'm going to add just a couple frame on it. Just one more tuck right there. So cute. All right. I 
connecting because I feel like I want some so much crystal here for me to use. All right, in. Oh my god, it's so cool. Like I can't even push it because it's stay it's really like the condensed blue jars and I know what taco will suck will suck your crystal in one place. So it's not going anywhere, but to stay right there for you. Oh my god, it's so adorable. All right. Ah, Wagner's. Hey, Fanny, thank you so much. Nene, thank you. Thank you, ladies. Okay, wipe on the sides and Kia for 60 seconds. Okay. All right, all my love. Like moving on to the next one, I am like really obsessed with these designs, and we're gonna use this too. And back to our condensed glue gels. And when we finish this one, I am going to use the precision glue gels at the same time. I'm gonna get the new one because look at that. I don't know. It looks like um, under the sea, though. Sorry. So. Getting a small amount, don't want it using too much and too little. Too much is going to flutter your crystal. Too little is not going to adhere your crystal properly, okay? So spread the uh, condensed blue gels evenly on the nails. If you know exactly where you are going to do your crystal placement, you can place it right there. However, sometimes your clients will watching and like, oh, can I add this one on? Can I have this one? Sure. So you, I always getting um, completely cover the nail so then that way uh, just in case they are just want to add something on i will never say no i want to say yes because when you're adding is more um techniques on it absolutely you can increase your ticket make your clients happier and you are going to be happier all right so condensed glue gels and floating the you know what taco on the top of unkeer condensed glue gels okay so now we are going to moving on with this beauty centerpiece it's cut heavy so beautiful so now i'm going to use this beauty here and i'm going to add them on like smaller size one two i'm going to do one and two And then add it on. One more. I would say this is like like SS uh, six. Right, add some beads on. On way at the beads on um, between the crystals and between the frame and frame between the crystal and crystal. And more beats in. Oh my God, I'm so excited to see everyone today. You don't know how much I'm excited about. All right, so you can stop this design at any time, which is so beautiful already. That's it, it looks so beautiful. And then you can add more. Hold on, let me add one more. Where's my friend though? I thought I have it here, right here. Thank you. One more right there. I 
I'm so obsessed with this like gloves crystal. Just remind me so much of that uh, glass museum. All right, I'm going to tuck in more beads to make it look really cool and finished looks. However, this is optional. If your clients don't want to add any, absolutely, you don't have to. All right. Two. I usually finish the design with the my kind of a triangle beads. As I say, you can stop at any time. Just add a couple more here. A couple more there. And one more on the end. All right. Happy with this, we are going to cure under the LED lights for 60 seconds. And this is the best time for you to adjust this beauty if you want to tuck it in more, move it left to right or wherever you want. It's not going to cure yet until we are going to cure under LED lights. So I'm gonna put the last beads in here. And then we are going to be finished with the design. All right. So if you don't put it, what next thing is using is a crystal picker. We got a wax tip to pick up everything else you want. And you have the, what's the other side? The dot two. Dot two, yes, to move everything around. Yep, you don't want it using a wax on the other end because you don't want to pick up the condensed food gels and no wet top coat and put it back into your crystal. So you want to use this and to adjusting and use this to pick the crystal. Use this one to do any other nail art or uh, adjusting your crystal the way you wanted it. So I feel like just a little bit. There you go. Perfect. Key for 60 seconds. This is cute, huh? Mm -hmm. And you know, I've never settled for less. Mm -hmm. Make sure that everything in life, do not settle for less. Do it more. Achieve more. Achieving, achieving uh, more is not the same as greedy. It's achieve more to just so then you can able to um, always better yourself. And get more things of your life. And you more things of your life and help a lot of others people out there. Yeah. Like you learning a new technique, guess what? Who's gonna be happy first? Your clients are gonna be so freaking happy because oh my gosh, look, my nail tech can do this. I trust me, like a lot of clients will be so proud of the nail tech can do a lot of things, like oh my god, see. Like, my nail tech will never be able to do that. Oh, my nail tech's got everything. She can do this, 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 this. You know, just make them so proud. And also, it's make you proud as well as you're working hard, dedicate. And then they're happy. And guess what? You'll be happy too because they keep coming back to you and stay in your chair for a long time, forever. Loyal clients. And then upsell your um, service. And the clients were willing to pay for your beautiful dedication, your techniques, and... Um, the products that you are using it on them. So that's my means by never settle for less. Don't ever think, oh my God, I don't feel greedy. You are never greedy. You're always doing it more to better yourself and helping a lot of other people out there. So don't let, don't let the worst is to shape you the way you don't want to be. Okay. Be you. All right. So now moving on to the last step from precision glue gel normally the clients will be like okay it looks so beautiful see you later nancy I said wait wait no come back because i don't want to see you tomorrow i love you so much but you don't need to come see me in the next few weeks you're seeing tomorrow it means something is coming off so we let do this so that is secure so you enjoy you don't have to drive here waste your gas and waste your time so i'm gonna double secure your crystal 
So um, I love you so much, but your next uh, appointments will be in the next like three or four weeks. Okay, so we're going to seal this one to make sure this beauty is going to stay last on your nails. So you see that how I show you, I squeeze it out only when you feel scratchy. Then you're going to squeeze it out. You don't squeeze everything out when you feel they are really tight right here. They're smooth and slick here. You do not need it because it's already sealed completely. But then when you go here, I feel scratchy right here. So, and when I do that, you know, when I ask a client, do you feel scratchy as you when I move it? Yeah, I feel it. So it means that it's more chance that it's going to catch on the hair and the clothes and the fabrics and anything. So yours going to seal those spots. And then, of course, you're going to seal it right on the top of the frame, but not on the top of the crystal. It's already gloved, so you don't need to make it more gloved than there. Like, is more is bubble look. So it's already beauty. And we're going to seal it here, the beads. I'm sealing all the beads to prevent from all getting tarnished and dull, rusty, because we are going to, is going to wash our hands zillion times a day. And using a lot of hand sanitized wipe and a lot of disinfectants at works and at home. So let protect this beauty so then it's staying. All right. So it's the best thing about this precision glue. Y'all look at that needles is going right here and it injecting all of uh, the precision glue. Y'all is it similar, is formula, but thinner density so it can go to all the edges. And it seals everything for us. All right. So here for 60 seconds. And then also when you feel like it's still scratchy after you get it out, the clients are, oh, my God, Nancy, I feel I have a lot of is clients like this. I'm not going to lie to you. They say, oh, my God, it looks good. And I said, okay, now you feel it first. I don't send them home until I make them feel their own design first because they are the one is feeling it the best. You really be careful. But and also you couldn't. Feel the way your clients feel it, you know. So I usually ask them, and then they say, "Oh, <clears throat> is this still scratchy? Can you able to add more on it?" Sure. And then you can always feel is to the area the clients feel it. <coughs> can I get some water, please? And then I think I need some water. It's hot and cold for this, so then we can show off the beautiful of the. Um, color change so i'm gonna seal this one as well cover this i'm gonna show you how cool this one gonna color change so you see that earlier it's already when i put it under led lights but wanna let do it again so you see that this one i'm gonna seal it and make sure that we don't flood it your crystal and we don't using too much right here scratchy i'm gonna see squeeze it and fill it in all right, so I am feel on the edges of a centerpiece as well, but I didn't do it on the top of the crystal right here. So then that way we can keep all your crystals so nice and sparkle. All right, here for 60 seconds on these two beauties. Let me show the camera quick. Okay. Oh my God, it's glowing it up. It's so cool though. So here is the nails that we did. I can't wait to see everyone in person. Chicago next month, September 11, 12, 13. Stop by at our booth. It's 54, I think 5403 or 5304. 5403 or 5304. Mm -hmm. 50, so booth in Chicago. 5403. 5403. We have a big post for yes, the. We do have a poster, so go yeah. look at our Facebook confirmation. So this is the grapes. I love the a lot because you know what? When this one chain, yours is polished stone. It chains with this too. It's so cool though. You see how purple it is, right? Which one? Change it. Let's change this one for a second. You know what? I'm going to get my nails with the uh, velvety gel. So you think? Thumbs up for me if you want to see my nails short like this. But using velvety gels because a lot of you are like, oh, I have a client with short nails. It's not like long nails all the time. Look at that, it's changing to the pink as well. See that? Because the background changing. So that translucence is uh, polished stones 
is for my baby Mitchell. It changes in. Thank you, Dini. Hello. Ah, Blooming's Beauty. Thank you so much. All right. So Hello. let me moving Hello. on. Oh, yeah. So, okay. Let me show you. There are a lot of them. So here's the grapes. Here's the beautiful grapes right there. I feel like I want to eat it, but too beautiful to eat. Um, and then moving on is um, this one, a coal. This one, a coal. So this is it's warm. It's going to change into like a light pink. And then when it warm, it cold, it changing it back into where it is. So dogger. Getting dogger now. It's cool. You put a cute ice cube in here. <laughs> Long nails on me. Nay, nay. I know, right? You said, okay, so back into the purple. You deep longer in there. It's going to be back into purple. Oh my God, sweet holidays at Vicky. It's just really cool. She put a hole in time. She put it in the freezer as a cup. I said, oh my God, it looks so stunning. So changing back into the purples, i loving it. And then let's move on. Let me see if I can find the raspberry. Oh, here we have raspberry right here. Right here. When it's warm, it's changing to this. Right? And then it's, here's it cold. It's going back to the hot pink. <gasps> oh, so beautiful. You see just lighter earlier? Sorry, I'm just tapping the waters off. <laughs> May, thank you so much. I hope I say your name right. May, May. Juki, Joyce, thank you so much for the batch. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you for supporting my passion. All right, so this is, I believe, this is also a raspberry. So if we're putting it here, it's kind of cold right now. So we're going to put it in the heart and see what's up with this one. Changing this. Nikki is... Uh, I will definitely gonna pass on a message to to the team. It might be a lost in maybe an hours like spam nails folder. So I got your comment. So definitely, uh, if you can't DM us and let us know your emails, please DM us and let us know your email so then we can able to uh, locate it for you. Okay? Yes, because sometimes if we get lost in the is a uh, spam folder. The same thing, sometimes we send the email to the clients that they couldn't get it because it go into the spam folder. So don't worry, we get you. And just make sure that we are getting your emails so then we can able to locate it. You are very welcome, Mini. Maybe first. All right, so, so that is the raspberry and then we're moving on to this is the grapes. So this is the when it warm, it's going to turn it like lighter, like a lighter pink, like a purple. And then now we're moving on to the coal. Coal is going to go back right into, look at that. It's already changing it. Ah, Aika, thank you so much. I, I will save the video for you. Look at that, how dark it is. I bet you're going to enjoy your velvety gels because you told us that you order it. So I can't wait for you to receive it. And then I can't wait to see your beautiful creation. This is so stunning. Either way, either lighter or darker color is stunning. Oh, my God. This is so, I don't know. Which one do you like better? Like what color? Darker or lighter? Like this one, when you get cold, which is that your tips, your tip when you're wearing your tips gonna always cooler than your nail paste because it's your body temperature. 
So it's going to be lighter. And then the you know, tips on the free edges going to be in like more dark colors. So. Awesome. Thank you so much, Nikki. Yes, we are really appreciate it. Thank you so much for amazing love and support. Yes, we are going to make sure that we located everything for you. Thanks so much, Blooming Beauty. I love it. It's so cool, though. This glove crystal, it is everything. It looks, when you turn it, it looks like, you know, it sparkles. and like it's like effects of the lighting. And it's so stunning, though. It looks like when you're weighing it, it looks like you're under the sea. So that is a grapes. And I look at this is a sunflowers that we did it on the other day. So this is a um, pole. Let's see when it's getting warm. Look at that. It's changing completely. Oh, it's lighter. And I did have a step-by-step -step for this one, so you can definitely check it out. I believe this is the um, the watermelons. And then we have, oh no, that's one a cherry, I'm sorry. This one a cherry. And this one is watermelon. So they're all cold, so I'm going to put it in the womb. And look at that. The watermelon is so stunning because it changing the colors. It looks exactly the watermelons that it had the red and then it's had a green. Look at that, how it turned into the green. So cool. So this is the watermelon. And this is the blueberry. Put in it's a blueberry. I love it how the blueberry is turning to like a pink pink. <laughs> like have a light pink, like a beautiful, like a peachy pink. This is blueberry. <laughs> it's so stunning. All right. And then guess what? It's lemonade. Lemonade is going to show us a lighter. More warm water is getting cooled down. Give me some hot warm water. And then, oh, another one says lemonade too. I really want to wear this one. I did this videos on the other day, so I saved them all. And I'm using the gloves, the blue one right here. Oh my gosh. Look at that. When it's cool and then when it's warm. You see the two, two colors, like, absolutely. And I'm going to show you how it's glow in the dark. So this is a grape. So we're going to dip this grape into this warm water. Nikki New Nail Juni. So I guess is that you are on YouTube yeah. uh, on the uh, Instagram too, yeah. So I hope that I assist you with the question. It's turning like a pink. Uh, all right. So this is a grapes. So I have three grapes. Nadi Nadi Na. Thank you so much. And what other colors? We have a lot of other colors that I did it on the other day too. And I did solid colors with ombre and chanfer foil encapsulate. So this is the uh, blueberry. And I using uh, Grandma Gardens is uh, chanfer foil to finish the looks. It's so cool though. This is the um, blueberry. This is the raspberry. This is cherry. And then it's watermelon. So this is all like, and I'm matching the name of the fruits collections 
thermal chains and glow it up. So, okay. And here is the solid colors. It will change and it will glow in the dark. So I'm going to show you. Um, ah, JC, hello. Hi, Queen Bass. So, okay. So we are going to move this one on the side and let's show you the uh, glowing dogs for this collection okay so today we did raspberry and grapes and then tomorrow we'll do watermelons and blueberry we're gonna do all the different colors because throughout this week it's a special special saving hope you're enjoying it's a saving great for velvety gels the newest collection is launched so you can absolutely enjoying it with a lot of savings. So hope you are definitely enjoying it and enjoy the tutorial. So let's see. Uh, can you turn all the lights off? All the lights off. We're gonna turn all the lights off for just a second, okay? Um, and I can show you. Here's these two nails that we did it today. However, let's show you all beauties here. see how cool is glow okay let me chalk it for a second make sure your clients all if your clients is outside and then on it's just automatically chalk with the solar let's see if i can get this one too oh my god i have one more hold on not yet <laughs> i can't i can't wait because i'm gonna show you all do it too later hmm? too late or too late Ready? All right. Can you once again? Good night, Aika. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you, Nene. Please be safe and take good care of yourself. Awesome. Yeah. Ready? Look at how cool it is. Absolutely glow in the docks. Here you go. You know why this tool is not glow? Because this have a chance for foy. So stunning. It had a chance for this is two nails. I just did it for you. So it had a chance for foy underneath. So it glow to wherever I ombre it. So cool. The two. Okay. Ah. Oh, so beautiful. All right. To all my love and thank you thank you for tuning in and i'm so excited i have a blast created all cool this designs for you if you have any questions any questions regarding to your order your products please feel free to dm us our team will definitely going to be assist you and happy to assist you and um on a lot of like is emails um i thank you so much for sending the information as well because we have there's so much emails coming through and we'll make sure that it's not lost into the spam, the spam folder. And also on the DM, we'll make sure that it's not lost into the request uh, DM. So I hope you really, really enjoying it. Tutorial today, let me show you what we're getting here. Grapes and grapes. Two grapes and two raspberry. Put in here. All right, yeah, sorry. I get you all. Here you go. And we did this too today. Grapes and raspberry. So special promotions for this is Velvety Gels is still available until is during this week. So take advantage from this and hope you enjoy the saving. And any question regarding to the products I use for great success in such, don't hesitate to DM us and email us okay so we'll be happy to assist you thank you so much everyone in the meantime please stay safe and take good care of yourself and i will looking forward to see you in the next live video thanks so much thank you thank you dom thank you so much everyone thank you so much for all of uh your love and support thank you blooming beauty Thank you, and uh, thank you so much for all supporters who bought the batch. 
and thank you so much everyone we'll see you in the next live videos have a good night bye